Games, 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 games. God, there's so many games. God, there's so many of them I want to buy. But I have no money. There is a game I've been looking at, and I... So this is not a review, because I haven't gotten it yet. It's only 20 bucks though, so... Uh, that is to say, it's not super expensive. But the game is called Death's Door. This is a... Souls-like, Zelda-style, dungeon-crawling action-adventure. Now, I've seen this. It was... Uh, it's been getting reviews from a lot of folks on YouTube already. Many of them seem to like it. I saw it feature... It first came to my attention when it was featured in an Iron Pineapple video. Check out his channel if you haven't, by the way. Uh, you're, you're more likely to have checked out his channel than my channel. And I gotta say... It looks good. It's something that I think I will download and I will enjoy. I'm going to have to get it on Steam because it is an Xbox console exclusive. I would love for it to be on PlayStation. I actually think it looks like it would play especially well on Switch since it's got kind of a top-down sort of... Not top-down, but more of a pulled-out camera view. Uh... And it looks really good. I want to play it. So I'm probably, like I said, going to have to get it on Steam, though. But I'm just kind of bringing this to your attention because the game is just getting a great amount of praise. The developers, which is just two guys, uh, have just been so thankful and have been talking up how just honored they are at that it's apparently being just met with near universal claim and that it's gotten over a hundred thousand players in less than a week which is very impressive for a small indie team i mean not even a team it's a duo so if you haven't checked out death's door please do so uh, either on Steam or Xbox. If you are playing on Xbox, though, be aware it is not on Games Pass. You will have to pay money for it. Oh, shocker. Ah, what the hell? Yeah. No, it looks like it's worth it, and it just looks fun. So I'm probably going to pick this up, and once I do pick it up, I'll be sure to give some commentary about it. Uh, so let me know what you think. Have any of you picked this up already? If so, tell me what you think. So maybe I'll have to have a much more informed decision going into it. Uh, thanks, and I'll catch you next time on Rated RPG. Later.